Here is an interesting exponential expression. We are asked to simplify 3 raised to the power of e minus 3 raised to the power of e minus 1 all over 3 raised to the power 3 multiplied 3 raised to the power e minus 27 multiplied 3 raised to the power e minus 1. And here is the solution. Now let us put down this expression. We have 3 raised to the power e minus 3 raised to the power e minus 1 all over 3 raised to the power of 3 multiply 3 raised to the power e minus 27 times 3 raised to the power e minus 1. Now let us focus on the numerator. We are going to expand this as well as expand this term here. Let's quickly do that. We have 3 raised to the power e minus 3 raised to the power e multiply 3 raised to the power negative 1. And we have this to be all over. You should understand that this is the expanded form of this term here. Nothing has changed. They are the same. We expanded this one to get what is here. So we have a denominator 3 raised to the power of 3 times 3 raised to the power e minus this 27 can be written as 3 raised to the power of 3 which is the same thing as 27 times 3 raised to the power e times 3 raised to the power negative 1. Similarly, we expanded this term to give us what is here. According to the multiplication law of indices, since both have the same base, we can use one to represent them and then add their exponent. And when you do that, you get back what you have here. Okay, now let's continue. Look at this numerator. There is something common to this side and this side, and that is 3 raised to the power e. So we are going to factor out 3 raised to the power e. So we put 3 raised to the power e outside, then open a bracket. This divide this gives us what? 1 minus and then this expression divide by this this we simply strike this and we are left with what 3 raised to the power negative 1 so come here to write 3 raised to the power of negative 1 all over similarly in the denominator something is common to this side and this side and that is 3 raised to the power 3 multiplied 3 raised to the power e is present here and it's also present at this side too 3 raised to the power 3 multiplied 3 raised to the power e so we're going to factor out one of them so we have 3 raised to the power 3 multiply 3 raised to the power e then open up a bracket this divide by this is 1 so we have 1 minus this expression now divide by what you have here this we simply strike out this and what we have left is 3 raised to the power negative 1 so we come here to write 3 raised to the power negative what 1 at this point this we simply strike out this so that we have left 3 raised to the power e all over 3 raised to the power 3 times 3 raised to the power of e. Now we can divide this, we go into this to give us 1 so that we have 1 all over 3 raised to the power what? 3. And when you do this, we get our final answer to be 1 all over 27. And this is our final answer. Thank you very much for watching.